Hey board gamers, BJ from Board Game Gumbo here, back with another unboxing. This time in the Gumbo Pot, we're unboxing Earth from Inside Up Games. It's one of the hottest games out there. We've seen it all over the socials, but I've never got a chance to play. So let's get to that Game Toppers LLC table and see what's inside. We're looking at the cover of Earth. You know, I've never really taken a look. It's actually pretty gorgeous. I mean, we've got this bright, beautiful, sunny morning, sun peeking out behind this, this big uh, plateau with the waterfalls right there. Gorgeous cover. This is a game designed by Maxime Tardif, presented by Connor McGoey of Inside Up Games. Connor, big, big uh, supporter of Southern Board Game Fest. And this is one of the games that we're going to have in our library. And there may even be a play to win. Don't quote me, but we'll take a, we'll have to look at the schedule and see that again. But make sure you go to southerngamefest.com and get your tickets because you could play this game for free at Southern Board Game Fest if you get your badge. All right, so inside the box, we've got big giant rule book. I like this. Oh, a how-to video from my buddy Paul Grogan from Gaming Rules. Make sure you check that out because he does a fantastic job on teaching. Look at this well-laid-out who did the editing of this thing? Daniel Mansfield. I, I already like this. This is a great representation of, of how to set up the game and all the player components. It's got, I mean, blow-ups of the cards. You can see what's actually going on in the cards. We've got the, an overview of how the turn works. And then activating the abilities, planning. This game's all about planting you know trees and different things and trying to score points and from what I understand there's a lot of actions on each other person's turns as as your abilities on your own cards are activated I <laughs> like like this you've you've got 90% ready to play now let's look let's look at the scoring reminders and the iconography index in the back of the player board and you'll be ready the rest of the rules are clarifications examples and a solo mode with some exceptions and specific details covered. Oh, big blow up of the cards to kind of get some reminders of how these work. Another example of the turn, the end game and how to do the scoring, and then a page for the solo mode and even a team mode. An index with, with where everything is in the game, in the, in the rule book. Nice, I like this. Good rule book so far. What else do we have here? We got um, achievement sheets. We see those sometimes in Stonemaier games. So just when you do certain things, you can actually sign your name on the achievement sheet. I like that. I'd post that up on the wall. The player board. Oh, wow. No. Player boards. Yeah, player boards. Okay. Got a bunch of them here. Five different player boards. I'll get a nice close-up of that. Looks like the market of cards, I'm assuming that's what this is. And then lots of punch board. Well, one. But it's got a lot of tokens in it. Uh, let's see how they punch out. Nice and easy. Well done. I'm assuming a first player token with either a polar bear or a nice little calm, serene waterfall. Um. Solo, maybe? With a fox, my favorite animal. Love them foxes. And I like foxes and wolves, so I like them both. I do like wolves. And um, wood badgers of fox patrol, so I'm always partial to the foxes. Lots to punch out here, all the different player colors. Look, I wonder if they did this on purpose. This is the Mardi Gras colors, gold, green, and purple right next to each other. On purpose, you think? Probably. And then blue and orange here for Florida Gators. So, interesting. Okay, so we'll get that. We're gonna punch that out later. Oh, lots of player pieces here. Big, chunky, wooden pieces. Oh, I like the way these look. They're like little trees here, I guess, or sprouts. Let me see if I can show that to you. And there is a ton of these things, a whole bag full. All the different colors, blue and gold and green and red. All right. Uh, cubes, 
I've played this a little in BG, BGA, although I didn't quite understand it. And I remember putting these cubes out everywhere. Like these are sprout cubes or something. That'll be interesting to, to mark out. Tons of wooden cubes. We got a whole bag full. Big chunky wooden cubes. And then some more of similar to those other tokens, but these are in kind of a wood color there. So obviously these stack up, and I, I remember this from BGA that you can stack these up. Nice. That, that stacks up very easily. Score pad, okay. Tons of, it's very uh, optimistic. Lots of scoring, it's double-sided. Yeah, it's a lot of games. You got plenty of scoring for, for what I'm gonna play. Uh, and then, wow, okay. Look at the size of these decks. That's a ton of cards. We're getting into all these games like Ark Nova and Earth and Wingspan where you've got, oh, and um, Mosaic, where you've just got tons and tons of cards, big giant stacks of cards. Lots of, I mean, these, these look like actual photos, just gorgeous scenery. This is of like ice flows around a big rock. Some stuff from the west, gorgeous scenery. All right, that's Inside the Box of Earth from Inside Up Games. Can't wait to get this played. Till next time, let's hit it. Bon temps roulette.